While these vehicles all share the road, they don't share the same bumpers. The Insurance Institute for Highway Safety is petitioning the federal government to regulate bumpers on light trucks, just as it regulates those on cars. SUV and car bumpers often don't line up, and when that happens, then the SUV bumper just becomes a battering ram as it overrides the car bumper and smashes into things like the trunk. You can see damage to fenders, tail lamps. To meet federal rules, car bumpers must be at least 16 inches off the ground, but that's not always the case for some light trucks, like SUVs, pickups, and vans. And according to the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, this is a real safety issue. In this 10 mile an hour crash test. To prove it, the organization conducted a series of crash tests. The tests involved four mid-size SUVs striking the back of a typical mid-sized car. One of the vehicles, a Ford Explorer, does a better job than the other three. The Hummer H3, the Jeep Grand Cherokee, and the Mitsubishi Endeavor. The Insurance Institute says that's because with the Explorer, the bumper is level with most mid-sized cars. The government has used ground clearance as an excuse for not regulating the bumpers on light trucks. But the results for the Ford Explorer show that you can have the utility of an SUV and still have bumpers that line up with other vehicles on the road. The IIHS hopes this new testing will help shape federal standards for the regulation of vehicle bumpers. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.